Hi, welcome to Washington, D.C. It's inaugural week. A little bit earlier you saw MTV's Rock and Roll Inaugural Ball, and right now we're giving you the Headbangers Inaugural Ball. Ricky Rackman here hanging out with Dave Mustaine. We're going to be checking out some of the sites around Washington, D.C., most of the sites that you see on the back of your dollar bills and coins. And we're also going to be playing some <laughs> videos and uh, talking about some of the stuff in Washington, D.C. Now, earlier you saw MTV's Inaugural Ball, and Dave, you were there, I was there, and I mean, President Clinton was there. Was that the first time you'd ever seen a president in person? Right, yeah. What'd you cool. think? Gotta love him. Huh? You gotta love him. I mean, it, to me, I didn't think it would really affect me that much, but it, I got goosebumps. Seeing the president right in front of you was pretty wild, and it's a pretty wild party, and we'll talk about the party. We'll talk about some more stuff as uh, Dave and myself are hanging around Washington, D.C. Right now, let's play a video from Guns N' Roses, a lighter side of GNR, finally. Here's Garden of Eden. Hi, Dave Mustaine and Ricky Rackman back standing in front of the Washington Monument, although it doesn't really look much like him. You just saw a live from Pearl Jam. And we're barely alive because it's about 32 below zero right now and we're freezing to death. <laughs> but we're doing it for you because we're walking around Washington, D.C. It's MTV's Headbangers inaugural ball. And we're walking around the sites braving the cold winter to play some very good videos for you and to talk to you about things like the Megadeth Tour and a brand new Megadeth video that we're going to tell you about a little bit later. And in a, very, very soon we're going to be playing a video for Megadeth, so stick around. Ricky Rackman here with Dave Mustaine standing in front of the Supreme Court. Now when you get in real big trouble, you end up here, real big trouble. Anyway, on Monday at 8 a.m., 2, 5, and 9, you will see a world premiere video from Megadeth. The song is Sweating Bullets, the video is Sweating Bullets, and you might remember when you gave me a tape of the uh, Megadeth album before it came out, I always said that, that was my favorite song on the record. I like that song. Tell us a little bit about the video before we're going to see it. Give us a little hint. Well, it almost killed me making that video. It's, if I had a, a window on my forehead, this is what you'd see. Really? So it's kind of... So you, you had a lot of say in the whole video. It's Absolutely not. <laughs> no. <laughs> they read your mind and, and that's yeah. what it is. Well, we're going to see another Megadeth video right now, Symphony Destruction. Anything you want to tell us about this video? Uh, this is political scum personified. And what better place to take it from than in front of the Supreme Court. Here is Megadeth. Dave Mustaine, we're visiting all the places that are on the back of all of your money or other people's money. Anyways, uh, right now we're in front of the Capitol building. Cops agree. And a uh, little bit about the tour. You guys are still on the road. Right, right. How's everything going? I mean, you, this is this is like your first headlining tour, isn't it? As far as arenas go? Uh, we're getting pushed out of the way right now by Officer Pork down there. <laughs> and. Um, about the tour, we're having a great time. Stone Temple Pilots opening up, MTV is sponsoring it. It's great. If you're not there, you're square. How many more American dates are there about? Too many. Really? All right, we're, so we're trying to do 300 dates in 365 days in 28 countries, and so far, so good. Really? So everything's going good? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, we'll be back hanging out at Headbangers Inaugural Ball with myself and Dave Mustaine, so stick around. Hi, Ricky Rackman <laughs> here with Dave Mustaine. We're freezing. In front of the Capitol <laughs> building. You know, it's MTV's <laughs> inauguration week, sort of. You saw all the big celebrations. Of course, most of those celebrations were all indoors where it's warm, and we're outdoors where it's very, very cold. Now, we're about to start a new era, brand new president. What do you think are some of the important uh, issues that the new president has to uh, address this term? Taking care of the young people, giving us jobs, and helping uh, raise the level of education per capita. Stuff like that, making sure that we're, we're safe and secure so that we want to stay here and fight for this country. Do you think that now we've got, you know, somewhat a younger president that he is going to address the young people? Because there were more young people out there <laughs> voting this time. You use that word somewhat, very loosely. <laughs> I think things are definitely looking up. I mean, it was really exciting last night seeing the president. I agree. You know, instead of looking at a dead president on a dollar, <laughs> mm -hmm. you know, it's really cool. I mean, I, I couldn't care less if I would have seen George Bush, but seeing Bill was really cool. I know? agree. It was, it, was, it was really neat seeing him. And I've never seen a president in person anyway. And right now we're going to be playing a video. How we go from Bill Clinton right into Nirvana. Here's a video from Nirvana. And we'll be back from Washington, D.C. Here in front of the Lincoln Memorial, and you've seen these... Uh, things and postcards and in TV and on the news all the time. And when you're here right in front of it, it's kind of awe-inspiring. want to remind you at 8, 2, 5, and 9 on Monday, you will see something almost as equally awe-inspiring, a new Megadeth video, world premiere on Monday for Sweating Bullets. 
I like the song a lot, so we'll see about the video. I think it's pretty cool. You know they have the same thing at Disneyland, too. <laughs> but it gets up and talks to you. Yeah, right, right. Now, uh, tell us about the band we're about to play. Uh, this band currently is supporting us on our tour in the United States and uh, happens to be a great band. A lot of people give them a lot of trouble on stage when they open for us. and. I mean, the bottom line is we chose them because we like them, and if you don't, you're going to feel just as stupid as I did when Motorhead opened up for Iron Maiden and I didn't know who they were. I look back and I think how fortunate I was to see them. This is Stone Temple Pilots. At the Lincoln Memorial, that was sex type thing by Stone Temple Pilots. Great song. It's uh, talking about uh, women's rights. Wiley the singer feels very strongly about that. I think it's very commendable what he's saying because there's a lot of misogyny in the rock business. I think it's a great song. I hope you find it equally as great as I do. Yeah, one thing he has said several times is a lot of people, when they hear the song, think that Wyland is speaking about his uh, personal beliefs when he's saying, I am, I am, but he's talking about another character, uh, not very favorable character. Listen to the song and also go see Stone Temple Pilots because they are opening up for Megadeth on the Megadeth tour, so make sure you show up nice and early to see them and enjoy them. And also at 8 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 5 o'clock, and 9 o'clock on Monday, something that we hope you will also enjoy, this is the world premiere of the new video from Megadeth for Sweating Bullets. And right now we're going to be playing a video from Skid Row. Another thing about Skid Row is that they've got their uh, Beside Ourselves record, which has got some cool coverage, including the Ramon Psychotherapy. Here is something older from Skid Row. Here it is 18 in Life, as MTV's Headbangers Inaugural Ball continues from Washington, D.C. Ricky Rackman here with Dave Mustaine. We're at the Vietnam Veterans War Memorial in Washington, D.C. And on this wall, the wall you've probably heard of many times, is the names of all the people that have lost their lives in the Vietnam War. And you hear all this stuff about going into bombing a certain country, and you kind of forget that lives are lost in war, and that's why peace is so important. And you see the names of the people that lost their lives in this war. We've got an opportunity to listen to a chorale here paying homage by singing the national anthem and another song that I wasn't quite familiar with. And also we're noticing some people here doing what they call rubbings where they'll put paper over the names and they'll trace it with charcoal and take that home as a memory. It's a very somber place right now and, and we get this great opportunity to pay homage right now. I see a lot of the people here who lost friends, relatives, and you know a lot of veterans themselves that are here for that served in the Vietnam War. We'll be back with more MTVs in August. Headbang Headbangers inaugural ball and when we come back we're going to play a video from Nine Inch Nails so stick around. Hi Dave Mustaine, Ricky Rackman standing across the street from my uh, new house. Uh, actually it's <laughs> Bill Clinton's house. It's a white house. You just saw Sweet Emotion by Aerosmith and uh, Ricky's going to tell you some information right now. This kind of a uh, interesting place that we're standing. I mean I don't even know if we're allowed to stand up here. You see secret servicemen all over the roof and it's pretty wild standing this close to the White House. Everybody's uh very much aware that we are standing here right now. I want to remind you tonight at 8 o'clock, MTV's Rock and Roll Inaugural Ball. Mr. Clinton, Mr. President, will be there. It's a very, very cool thing. We were both there and I had an amazing time. A lot of famous, famous, famous people were there. And uh, Dave and myself will be back tomorrow at 3.30 p.m. And that's it from Washington, D.C.